I would work on her getting off the couch when asked. Um, so I just want to do a quick video demonstration. Honestly, you do not have to make a training session out of this just because um, your dog may get a little frustrated. However, if you're one of those like, hey, I won't practice it or remember to practice it or we'll be prepared for such, um, you can do this as a training session like my, how I'm going to demonstrate. Uh, but generally, when I'm asking a dog to get off the couch, I just will say off and then I add some kind of pressure. So either I'm physically pushing them off, if I'm grabbing their collar and leading them off, if I'm getting a leash and leading them off, um, it's something of that sort, right? So it's a little bit of negative reinforcement. Do not be yanking them and yeeting them all around the room. It's very smooth and slow. Um, and it's just a little bit of pressure where the dog starts getting, getting the hint of like, hey, this is where I need to go. And then when they're on the ground, you need a reward. So what I typically recommend, again, if you are uh, one that doesn't want to practice this as a session, is either have like a jar of kibble treats or something beside the couch that you can reach, or if you're prepared, you can have some in your pocket. Um, and any time the dog is down on the ground, you're going to reward by tossing food on the ground. Uh, and this is just going to reinforce like, hey, off doesn't mean you, uh, it's nothing negative, I just need you to move, all right? So this would be a good example, although she just grabbed a toy and laid down. Remy, can you come up on the couch? She's like, maybe. I'll show you guys what she's doing, she's got a toy. Do, 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 do. What do you got? What do you got? All right, let me see if I can get her over. If not, I'm gonna grab a leash and we're just gonna set her up for this. So I'm going to invite her on the couch, or if the dog's already on the couch, I know it's a big couch. Super. Good girl. Um, so I'm not going to tell her off right away, uh, it, just because she was a little hesitant on coming up here. Uh, obviously, your dogs would be a little bit more comfortable at home, right, uh, getting on their own couch and stuff. Uh, but really what you want to do is just make sure you're not making this such a negative place. Like if you use off and then you're angry about it or forceful about it, the dog is going to start, if you have a resource guard, it's going to start guarding and getting cruddy with you back. Um, or you're going to just kind of crush the dog. So I have wild dogs on the furniture. Like they just got to get off when you, um, uh, you tell them to. And then once you are consistent, like if there's a little bit of pressure, off means off and they're not getting away with it. Um, and then... It, it becomes a command, right? So, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're a wet mess. You're a wet mess. You ready? Ready. Off. A little leash pressure. I point to the ground. She's down. I reward. I know, there were so many in my pocket. I don't think you need all those. All right, I'm going to demonstrate again. And again, this is a training session. You don't have to do it this way. I actually prefer you not to do it this way. But if you know you're never prepared or like can't reinforce or be too busy or something, um, then obviously make a training session. That way they can just learn the command. So, hop up, hop up, super. And I'm gonna reward her for coming up just because this is a lot of pressure for a dog, right? Ready? All we're gonna get in my pocket. Ready, off. A little leash pressure, good. I mark when she does it correctly, and then I'm going to reward. All right, so that's kind of all there is to it. Um, if you don't have a leash, I usually recommend getting a leash, but if you don't have a leash um, on your dog, say you're just doing this uh, as not a training session, just a little bit of pressure here. A little bit of pressure um, on the collar or something. So, Remy, off. Oh, super nice. Just like that. Um, if your dog doesn't have a collar, you can add a little neck pressure. Um, I do want to say if you have a resource garter of the furniture, please use a leash. Do not use your hands or anything. Um, it becomes a little too personal, right? So, all right, that's it. You ready?